Happy Friday. Principle number two, hope. The definition, the best definition that I have kind of come up with or found is confidence in the future. It has a little slight, slight leaning into trust. Um, and it is in the scope of theology or God. And that's, for me, it's a little bit more, I wouldn't say ambiguous, but more uh, open than that. Because, I mean, I believe in God. I believe in this energy. I don't know. I don't believe in a man in the sky. I believe in this energy, this source, this... There's a hope in that. So that is what I have. I have hope. There's, and it's not tangible. It's not something necessarily scientifically proven. I have hope. And I don't think you can't scientifically prove hope. It's just something that's within me. It's a confidence. It's a trust that I have, um, that I've always had um, a hope for something better. As long as I can remember, as far back as I can remember as a, as a child, as depressed or upset uh, with my life and circumstances, um, I always envisioned in the darkest of times looking down a tunnel and seeing a flickering of light. And I, I can't explain that image um, better than that. That's the, I, and I can't, I can't explain the source of that image in my mind. And the tunnel seemed forever, but I, and the light would go off, it would flicker, and I, I just like I just got to keep walking. And I, and I'm talking about, sadly or truthfully, the suicidal thoughts, the life is never going to change. And, and the thought that kept me going was this image, that things are going to get better. I don't know how, and I don't know when, but I keep walking. I just keep taking that next step. That is, to me, is, is, is my, is hope to me. Um, and I, there's, there's no, it's not necessarily a rational, um, component to that when I witness or I engage and encounter people that have been through crazy uh, you know <laughs> in intense situations um, and they've gotten through it that gives me hope I, I don't know so number one honesty starting with me you know am I honest with myself do I know who I am, what I am, how I serve? And then I step into this, you know, next idea of hope. Something, it's like, I feel like hope to me is like energy. It just changes. It's always there. I always have it. And I, as depressed as I can get, it's still there. It's like, <sighs> grateful. I'm grateful that there's always been a bit of hope for me. Because I've had, you know, I don't know, I've had worse times than some and better than others. And, you know, this thing has gotten very dark um, and still does. I cycle through times of darkness. And I've been diagnosed with a myriad of different things. But, and I don't, personally, do not, for me, just for me, I don't take medication to change that. Um, maybe I don't have the psychological things that people think I have as badly as others, um, or have diagnosis, but I have hope that, I, yeah, faith, that's the next one, so that's tomorrow. Um, I don't know, babbling. Much love. Happy Friday.